Welcome to Abacus on Twitch, and we are streaming right now. Uh, we're streaming NetEase's new game. And I'm hearing my, myself about like five seconds late. Oh, cool. And okay, so it's go time. It's go time. So Identity 5 uh, is a NetEase smartphone game. It's quite a quality game, asymmetrical. Um, yeah, so like the basic storyline of that is was that you play as a detective and then um, you go investigate in a uh, haunted manner and um, you know, uh, in that house, battles between a uh, hunter and some visitors took the place and then you're trying to figure out how and why and um, so it's pretty cool. So let's, you know, get into it. My name is Zorfius. So, this is the set Once of a novelist, story. Uh, but after losing amazing. my memory, Animation. I couldn't complete uh, any valuable writing. Now I'm just a private detective. Uh, this game uh, until became I received a strange request investigate an infamous estate to find a man's about, lost like, daughter. Two, two or three months now. Besides the check, it was the name on the letter that intrigued me. Not Orpheus, so, uh, but. You got a letter? So, got that, uh, you know. Is actually you are commissioning a uh, detective to do the dirty work for you, which is to find out like, what happened. So I'm gonna go with my ruthless. And okay, so yes, I'm Joe the ruthless. alias that almost nobody knew. So going into it, um, you're the detective, like I said. It's hella spooky. Um, The game was it initially got very 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 good reception in, in China. It got about like 50 million downloads, and then uh, it became globally available about um, two weeks ago, and then it got over 100 million downloads. Um, and then, then the localization with like translation and all that is pretty on point. Um, it's quite rare that we see a bunch of. I mean, I mean we we see a good. Um, quality Chinese game coming out of China, but there, there's a bunch of backstory to it, and, and I'm going to shut up because the story is actually ha happening. So as you see, you know, um, everybody has already abandoned uh, this house, and then you walk into it, um, trying to figure out what's happening. And this is not just animation, you know, this is actually like in-game rendering. Um, you walk around as a... As a detective, look, just look at his face. Just look, look at this detective's face. Um, it's pretty, pretty nice. Um, it's all 3D, cause, and you can control navigation, direction, um, anywhere, anywhere on on, a, uh, on your device. So we're playing with an, an iPad. Um, yeah. So right now we're just lighting candles. So we see like traces of. Um, so we light another other candle. We're trying to collect some clues. Oh, what's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Oh, cool. We find other other candlestick. Oh, look at that paper plane. So we are still following the footsteps. So we're picking up the paper plane and see if there's any sort of clues. 
so the magnifiers. Folding techniques. The page just looks new. Oh, I wonder what's happened. Ah. Oh, oh so, right, we're getting some uh, questions from the chat. Why am I in this creepy house? Well, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a detective. I'm just trying to handle business. Oh, I have a PhD in catastrophe. A master in disaster. Okay, lots of information. Cool. So, this looks like a page from a diary. Interesting. The date is from several days ago. And this is where the interesting bit comes in. And, you know, like, so you start case uh, restoration. It's very much like, you know, uh, like you play any of the Dark Knight stuff, uh, the Batman stuff. Um, it kind of does that, but then that's where um, it introduces the battle system in this game. And you saw that flashes, I mean like, you know, like, they're all in Ch Chinese. So like, like, in general, the game is localized pretty well, but, but then there's still, like, here and there you see that, you know, it's, it's you know, the original uh, version is the Chinese one. <laughs> so I slam a finger to look around. So like this, this is like you know basically in your detective mode, trying to figure out what's happening, right? And then there's this like <coughs> the ghost of a a visitor, and then you're doing your um, whole deduction thing. Oh, just look at his face. So this is like very much like, like the Telltale games. Um, in this, how it was at all, this cover clues and all. <laughs> Robbie said, "I just, I'm gonna die," but it's just the beginning. Oh, so we're getting some like Doctor Strange. Uh, body separation action. Right here we are, like enter the body of that visitor and we're trying to understand what's going on. Oh man, look at that car. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, this guy we're, we're trying to kill, kill me. And I'm gonna escape. Run! I'm out of this thing, right? And I find a little buddy of mine, a little shelf of mine. Come on. So what's, what's going on? We got to decode some uh, cyber machine. Oh, what's, what's this that? Who is? Run, run, Josh, run. Who the hell? Okay, the survivor's objective is to decode the cyber machine. So, um, we can actually, what is it? Use our uh, finger to rotate our camera angle. And so, see, see I'm like working with a buddy right here, trying to decide what's going on. Yeah, I'm run running, I'm running. Yes. Uh, so, take action. So, uh, this is how I exit the gate. So, uh, the whole, whole game of it, what is it? The bulk of it is actually like you know, a multiplayer asymmetrical battle. So, you play either as a survivor or, or like 
Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> or, 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 um, the hunter. But then, the game can walk you through the mechanics of it by presenting a single player, um, kind of narrative. And now that is the first step of you know, teaching you. So like you got to decipher, oh, you got to decode the cipher uh, tower, and then also you have to so it was escape from by uh, opening the gates. And then we're going back to the tutorial. So basically, it's the storyline. Oh, my echo is bad. What's happening with that? My echo is bad. Some people complain about my echo. Am I still open? Could you open this? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, right now like, I'm finding more. Um, um, so you're, working on this is you're working on your echo. We're trying to figure it out. Yeah. Okay, so what I'm trying to do. What am I trying to do? Yeah, I just say we're, work we're working on the echo. We're figuring it out. My bad. I mean, even though I'm, I'm the only person to appear on screen, but then there are a bunch of action happening on the background, to be honest with you. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, I'm gonna continue. So, what's going on is, right now, we're looking for, for more clues from this little... around the house again um, trying try to discover more clues but to be honest with you I'm because I'm playing uh, from I this iPad this right here here is a lot That's not harder to hold um, as opposed yeah, to you yeah. know if you just like you know playing off of a phone yeah, it's much easier to kind of like navigate the chimney has been sealed off so the chimney no, has been sealed off Seems the owner didn't use a fireplace, and this true purpose clear. remains unclear. So yeah, there's so something edgy about that. Let's figure out what's behind it. Oh, now like we introduce the game is introducing its uh, diary system. So like you know, diary it can kind of like present you with um, you know with, with more thorough details about the backstory. So like here is the letter. Um, this is the girl that, you know, Joe the Ruthless is, is commissioning uh, this detective to find, which is Joe, Joe, Joe the Ruthless' daughter, it's my daughter. So, yes. And you get a scatter. Yeah, so uh, these are where, where all the clues uh, reside. Some pretty, some pretty creepy stuff, you know? So the day six, six final day is about to begin, and I hope it's worth it. Someone's out, so stupid, stupid. If they don't even know how to spell rules, rules. Uh, thank God, I wasn't the first one to try that. Nonsense, this is all nonsense. What the hell is going on? Why did he go for me? Damn. But, but right now, we can just walk around the house for a little bit more. Why? This candlestick is... I think I know what Yeah, this candlestick is a bit extra, huh? It's firmly attached to the fireplace. It seems to actually be a part of the fireplace. This is pretty important. What happened to the other dude? The other dude, um, he's just a pigment of my imagination. So like, I'm trying to figure out what's going on. Um, I'm trying to play, play a lot of dudes, actually. That's a reply to Robbie's question. Obviously, we, we just found a treasure trove of 
lot of clues because he uh, flipped open the wall, which is actually a shell. Um, the hunter of the books that look exactly the same come to focus. Uh, intuition told me that the page I was hiding in my hand came from one of those books. And it was this simple fact that. Yeah. I used to be. Anchorman, man, sorry about the echo. My boss child. is buying a new mic microphone now. Totally, uh, unprofessional, the unprofessional, the unprofessional of ours. But, um, we're streaming, so that's the start. Uh, okay, we're looking at more books. So, so someone came here willingly, someone was attracted by treasure, no one is able to leave the manor. Violate the rules, will be knocked out, and, and the diary is a significant. I mean, just look at these details. You know what I'm saying? Like, the localization is actually done pretty well. I mean, you can still spot some like here and there, a little inconsistency with like the translation and whatnot. But it is in general, it's pretty good, pretty solid game. Especially like, like considering it's on mobile, like it has quite some potential. Questions than they have answered. It seems I shall have to apply a somewhat archaic so, yeah. to obtain the information that I need. And we're starting the case with rest restoration again. And I still, still got. Oh, yay! Back to clown! Wow, those comments. Hey, I'm trying to was escape, so uh, I will reply to those comments a bit later. So what's going on? Hold on. What's happening? What's this happening? Oh, what are those? those? Okay, okay. I'm, I'm gonna decode the ciphers. Okay, we got those target area. You are. Yes or no? Maybe so. <laughs> Your notification is here. Uh -uh. So it actually involves some pretty tactical uh, moves. Lose the hunter. What? That action button. Oh man, oh man, that clown is behind me. What am I trying to do? What am I trying to do? Run! Wah! I got knocked. Keep running. He's not behind me. Yeah. No sweat. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going, boy. Okay. 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 So I need to find the exit. Let's do that. Come on. Walk away. So yeah, we're almost, almost there, almost there, get the hell out, get out, get out, get out, ooh, 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 yeah. Okay, we 
manage to escape it. So um, that's pretty much uh, the basic mechanics of the game. Um, but now I would like you know, I'll show you. Um, we play about like half an hour, maybe. Um, so the bulk of the game is that we play as a detective, and then we go through, and then we will just discover clues about like these characters. We are not. This is like the first characters that come uh, into the story. But then. Yeah, so like, you know, we got external trades, potential trades, rumor, and all the backstory behind them. Um, so we got all, all that. And then that's basically how we kind of uh, come, come to understand what's going on um, in this haunted house, like, like many, many years ago. Not many years ago, maybe like, I don't know the exact timeline, but um, the battle system, um, the, you know, like, the battle that uh, just happened between the clown and the survivor is basically the bulk of the game and um, so like it offers you know a little bit of both uh, multiplayer and single player experience um, so but, but like in real matches this is like you know uh, one hunter with uh, go going up against four visitors uh, so yeah um, I understand that there are a lot of uh, technical issues as to happening um, but this is our first try at you know showing this awesome game, awesome game. Um, so yeah, so I think we, we this is gonna be a wrap, and then we're gonna come back back tomorrow, um, so that we'll bring you a better experience. We get get we get a new microphone for sure. Um, right now, the echo is killing everybody, and we don't want to pollute the internet anymore. Um, thank you for watching.